What is this box about? I can zoom in on the box. <laughs> How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Flint's Place. Today, we are checking out Slender Dark Woods, a free new hard game available over in the I'll have a link in the description box down below, right down there, as well as links to my Patreon, Discord, and Twitter if you'd like to check any of those out. Disclaimer, please keep in mind that the following game contains flashing lights, jump scares, loud noises, and disturbing content. Continue at your own discretion. Okay. <laughs> this is a little bit ha very happy cat bug esque. Okay. Information in order to maximize the gaming experience, use headphones done and play in a dark and quiet room well chip's actually out for a walk right now so this is a perfect time to play and uh as for darkened that ain't happening because i have some very bright lights on my face right now oh it's got local co-op too that's pretty neat settings this all looks pretty standard and it looks like you can play with mouse and controller yeah so player two would use the uh, controller and player one use that's pretty neat okay i, I like that we're gonna check out single player easy unlimited battery slender is quite nice eight pages Lots of batteries. Slender is getting more aggressive. Let's do normal. There are secret locations hidden in the woods. Press enter to start. Okay. I'll hit the enter key, which actually doesn't say enter, I'm realizing. It's just a little arrow thingy. Ooh, cutscenes. So yeah, this is a Slenderman game. Find eight pages. Good to go. I'm actually really... Jeez. Okay, that was a thud. I've played quite a few Slender games on my channel, as well as Slender uh, The Arrival, which I really enjoyed. So, always looking forward to finding random keys. Okay. Can't open that door. This looks nice. I'm actually shocked. I wasn't expecting it to look this uh, this good. Rather uh, interesting. And of course, as always, a Slenderman game requires you to get lost in the woods as you look for pages. It looks like that's not all we're getting. We're also going to be getting batteries and keys. We have one of six keys already. You are exhausted. Rest of run again. Okay, yeah, we're running out of breath. Because I sprint everywhere. Because as a person, I do not like to wait. Here's some... Oh, it's a clock in there. I was thinking, like, center around chopping wood or something like that. I'm a little concerned. Oh, I've used one of my keys. Okay, I, I get it now. We use a key, we carry, and we get to go into this house. Um, now, do I want to do anything in the house? It's, an, uh, it's a completely different question. I do not have an answer for it quite yet. Go upstairs. Oh, I found, it, I found my first note. Wow. That was very, uh, that was very purple. I think the best way I can describe that is battery. Okay. Howdy. Creepy noises. Is that a hole in the floor? Yes, it appears to be a hole in the floor, which I can drop through. Awesome. I like that. A little shortcut slash way to get, get away from Slenderman if he follows you upstairs. What is that noise I keep hearing? Don't like that noise at all. All right, I'm finding a lot of batteries and I found another key. Which is probably for the best because if I don't have a battery, I'm just going to be in the dark and alone. I found another key and another note. Yay, purple. Uh, I'm exhausted. I need to chill on the running so much. What is this box about? I can zoom in on the box. <laughs> okay, nope. Mm-mm. Well, Blenderman's just kind of standing there in creepy AF and scaring the bejesus out of me. Okay, I need to not look at him. That's... I gotta remember the rules of Slender. Just don't look at him, because that's how he kills you. He's still up there? I hope he's still up there. Grab that other battery. What's with these crates that I can apparently interact with, but I can't actually... Okay... I don't like those sounds either. Um, maybe I need to find a crowbar or something? That's the only thing I can think of. I also don't know how large this map is. I might be running around a lot, trying to find all these notes. Uh-uh, not looking. I gotta go this way. There's some debris, which I think I've already checked out. I'm exhausted, I have to stop sprinting. I need to learn how to chill out and just be calm. 
you know, as calm as you can be while there's someone trying to murder you in the woods. Uh-uh. Nope. You're going this way. Okay. Do not let my stamina run out. That time I was smart. Ooh, a barn. Okay. Can I crouch? I can crouch. Interesting, interesting, interesting. This is a book. I don't need books. I need... I don't know where he is. Okay. That's... That's neat. Oh, I found a, there's a knife that apparently makes my vision go very blurry. And I think there's an owl that's like freaking out out there. Oh, I don't like any of this. Oh boy. So all I did, all I did in here was I found a knife that I can't actually pick up and made my vision go all fuzzy fuzzy. Yeah, that seems kind of weird that there's a, there'd be a knife there. And my battery is about to die at 2%. Oh, I'm still crouched. That's why I'm moving slow. Duh. That makes a lot of sense. I'm over here trying to wonder where. Uh-oh. Yo. I could not find all pages. Okay. I like this. I like this a lot, actually. This is cool. I don't know why I, I, I didn't just click restart. Why did, I, why did I go back to the menu? Okay, this is pretty cool though. I like this. This is pretty neat. I keep saying the word pretty, but it looks nice. It looks very... It looks like an actual game. <laughs> Not a free game. So, uh, let's get back at it again. The Krispy Kreme. We're going over this way. I'm gonna check this. This is actually, I think, the exact same way I went last time, but it's, it's this is fine. Everything's good. All right. So I gotta try to think about how I want to do this to the point where I don't don't get completely murdered like I've I've been doing. I've been getting murdered quite a bit. So let's um let's try to not do that if I can help it. Also, I'm assuming typical Slenderman fair is. The game will... That's another knife up there that I can't quite see because I can't look up fully. But it looks like there's a knife in stone. So if I pull it out, do I become King Arthur? Is that how it works? I hope so. I could use... I could use the power. Um... Oh, battery over here. So... I'm guessing there's no... I don't know, actually. Oh, there's a note. Give me, give, give me the purple. I like the sound effects too. Like the sound effects are creepy, but like just the right amount of creep. It's not like... Okay. Like it's not like it's just throwing stuff at you for no real reason, but it is uh, definitely throwing stuff at you. Okay, so we're in this nice looking little cottage. We found a manacle, which I don't think I really need that. So what is with this? Can I do anything with these glowing boxes? Oh, I don't like that sound. No sorry. Oh, did I not pick up that battery? There you go. Now I got it. I just have to not get killed. Easier said than done. Another key. Key at two out of six. Two out of six keys. Or er, sorry, three out of six. I'm not good at counting or reading numbers, evidently. Or apparently finding the edge of the map because I keep doing that. What is that? That's a syringe. Why is there a syringe there? I have many questions now. Okay, so it does. It, it, I do think everything's randomized. It's just, I'm going to get lost a lot, I think. We're back at this house. So how's everyone doing today? I'm doing okay, you know. Happy to be playing a game that's not super duper depressing, like the last two I have played. Um, and honestly, I like Slenderman games sometimes. Like, I'm not going to be like, hey, it's it's Thursday, let's, let's play Slenderman, but... On the other hand, I'm like, hey, once in a while, not bad. Not bad at all. Nothing here. 
go up here. There is a note here. Hmm. So maybe it's not randomized, randomized and maybe I'm just dumb and I missed the first note. That's very possible. Very, very possible, not very impossible. It's impossible. It's Rigatoni. Rigatoni would actually be a decent name for someone, like a nickname for someone. Like if they worked at Olive Garden and their name was Tony, I would totally call someone Rigatoni. All right, so now we can expect to see the Slenders. The man of the slender. Battery on my flashlight's about to die. I really should stick to paths. I feel like that's a oh I can, I can I can oh I can just reload my flashlight by hitting R. It would make sense if I read you know the controls like I did, but didn't actually comprehend what I was doing with the controls. So R no, not good. Okay, not going that way. Gonna go this way and get lost in the grass. Yep. yep. So Slenderman was over towards my right. I'm going to go check out what the f why is there a lighthouse here? What is this? A chapel of some sort? I'm exhausted. I need to rest. Oh, there's a note though. I can't go through that door, but I can pick up this note. That's three out of eight. I got, almost got stuck and I was going to say, oh no, mm -mm. I don't want to be stuck there. I also like the animation they have for when Slenderman catches you. So one thing I thought was missing in the original Slenderman was like some kind of impact for dying. Kind of spooky impact. And like thrashing around, pretty creepy. I'll take it. Is there not a note here? Wow. Oh, nope. Mm -mm. I'm stuck. There we go. Slender Man just sees me running into a wall for three seconds straight. Like, you know, I could kill him, but it's, it just doesn't have the same fun. It doesn't have the thrill of the chase. And it's just me running into tombstones for five seconds. Uh, I think I'm on the edge of the map. Yep. I mean, I understand, like, you don't want to put up walls or anything like that in your game because it kind of does, it kind of does pull from the immersion when you keep running into walls, but invisible walls that just look like the rest of the level, I've never been a fan of that. Oh man, my stamina is not coming back quickly. Okay, it, it does return slower if you move. So if I just kind of, like... Have a brisk walk. So that does. No, oh, maybe. Yeah, if you stand still, it's actually definitely faster. But if you stand still, Slenderman probably can kill you easier. Okay, there's that knife again. And there's a box. Why box? Okay, never mind. We're we're going. We're going. Screw up. Oh, okay, that's another invisible wall. I can't go through. I can't fit through there. Okay. Doki. Here is a door. Use the key. Got myself a battery. Probably gonna be a note over here. Yes, indeedly doodly. Well then. Uh, nothing else in here. It appears. So out we go. <laughs> oh god, this is actually getting kind of tense now. Halfway there. So Slenderman doesn't seem to be moving too much. Which is the thing I see in a lot of Slenderman games. It's like, they make him chase after you. Which I feel like kind of, kind of works, but at the same time, oh god, it's so dark. I need to turn the light on here. I also can't close the door. See, I don't know if Slenderman understands how hands and doorknobs work. Like, would it be viable to close the door on... Did it just close? Oh, no, it did not. Okay. Would it be viable to just close the door on Slenderman? Would he be able to get out? Or get in, even? There's nothing here? Oh, God, creepy sounds. I don't think... Oh, did I pick that up already? 
Was there two there? I just didn't realize it. Looking down all the pews to see if there's a note maybe I'm missing, but I don't see one. Maybe on the floor? No, I don't think it'd be on the floor because you can't look all the way down. I mean, that'd be very mean to do that. But at the same time, I'm not seeing anything on the pews, which, I mean, this seems like choice area uh, to put something. Oh, maybe it's on this right-hand side. I just didn't check it. Nope. Nope. Go all the way around. No. There's no note here. Well, yes, I'm going to continue on. And seriously, hopefully not get murdered. Oh, oh. This looks like a cemetery gate. And much like the Pandora, uh, pa Pandora, Pantera song. Jeez, I can't talk today. My mouth has gone dumb. Much like the Pantera song, I'm a little terrified. Actually, pan the Pantera song is pretty damn good. I enjoy it. Oh. Nope. I'm, I'm screwed. I am screwed. I'm screwed. I'm stuck in it. I'm going to die in a porta potty. Oh no! I shouldn't have done that. Should I have? Have I just? Have I just? Did I just screw up by by glitching into an area I'm not supposed to be in? Oh, there's Slendy. Okay, let's hope I can get past the fence somehow. I think he's lost it. I need to rest. Oh no! Oh, thank God I can get over this way. Oh, whew. And the best part is Slender Man did leave. So I have that that wiggle room I needed. Oh, there he is. There's our boy Slendy. Hmm. Fantastic. I need a key to unlock this door. Do I? Can't I just click climb over the barrel? And I keep making myself exhausted. I need to stop doing that. Nope. Nope. Um, hmm. So I'm trying to figure out the Slenderman mechanic of how he moves around. I think he just teleports to a spot and if you look at him too long, you die. Not someone, it, it really does not seem like he's chasing you. Wow. Or he could just drop down. I literally saw him fall from the sky in front of me. Oh boy. But yeah, he just stands there. Staring at you menacingly. With his empty eyes. And then you just have to turn tail and run quickly. Let's go ahead and just refresh our flashlight. I'm back here. Again. Is there... Nope. Nope. I was hoping there'd be a note there, but there's not. This is always the, par always the part of the game I hate the most. When I find half of the notes, and the other half are just in, like, another game. The other half of the notes are in the Evil Within. Like, good luck finding them. Because, one, I don't know where I am half the time. Not even in the game. I mean, in, like, in real life. <laughs> No, but like really, like I, I'm back at the cemetery again somehow. And I think before when I was in the cemetery, I went to the left, so I want to go up this hill. Is this good? Okay, I'm pretty sure I just. Oh, why is the moon so red? So I've checked this out before. No, I have not been here before because there's a battery there. Hmm. Okay. If I've not been there before. Oh. That's a red thing. Which means it's spooky time. But also that means that's completely new because I've not seen that room before. Or that uh, tower before. No. No note on this container. Hmm. I really expected it to be there. Okay. Well, nope. He's over there. Alright, so let's get ourselves away. Okay, we're at this um, radio tower thing, looks like. 
So I'm gonna climb up it? I'm gonna climb up it. I can't climb up it. Climb up this side? No, I can't climb- okay, just- I can't climb up it. It's the extent of it. He's right there, I can see him. But it didn't play the spooky sound. Which is actually scarier because it, it didn't alert me, that means. Okay, key. Uh, I don't know, note? Batteries? Anything here? I'm seeing nothing. Okay, I don't know where he is. Oh, there he is. There's the sound. Man, that is a loud noise. Definitely wakes you up in the morning. That should be an alarm tone. Best part of waking up is slender in your cup. I don't even drink. I don't even drink Folgers. I started. I started getting into a uh, whole bean coffee recently, and I don't want to seem like I'm being bougie or anything like that. But man, whole bean coffee is good stuff. If you get good beans, of course. Right now, I'm drinking Pete's coffee, um, the Luminous Blonde. I think it's a luminos, luminosa. I don't know. It's a light roast. It's and uh, it, it mm, mm, not fond of it to be completely honest. I mean, I understand like a light roast is going to be a little more sour, a little more um, not heavy, I guess. Lighter, duh, light roast. But I'm I, I'm I gotta say I'm actually a fan of like that bitterness that you get from a, a heavy roast or dark roast coffee. Nope, not looking away. I think I just went in a giant circle. Yes, actually, I am fairly certain I just went in a huge circle and did not. Oh, great. There he is. Oh, it's that boy. What up? All right, what about here? Is this something I care about? No. Oh my god, there's just so much stuff I don't care about. And I am finding. The worst part is I am finding new areas. It's not like I'm just going in circles or anything like that. This is some of this is new stuff. There's that boy. Let's uh, get away from him. And by new areas, I mean I'm back at this house. How the hell did I do this? Okay. I think I should go back inside. I should go back inside. Just take a look around. See if maybe I missed a key. Oh, 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 oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I have another key. Which means I can get into that one area that I couldn't get to before. Oh, hate that sound. Snapping branches in the woods, never a good noise to hear. And I need to stop running out of I gotta stop holding down sprint so much. Character cannot take that much. Character needs to upgrade the cardio. It's treadmill. Okay, so from here, where was I think it was over this way. I'm trying to find that one building that had. Wait, did I not even go that far from that building? Anyway, I'm trying to find that one building that had the little side door. Thinking that side door is where I want to go. Over here, it's a battery here. Oh, there he is. Okay, and that's the invisible wall. That's the invisible wall. This is all invisible wall. Fantastic. Oh, there's so much invisible wall to be found. Am I good? Am I good? I think I'm good. Actually. I think I want, one day want to just do like a little review of my own of my coffee stuff because I have a bunch of different ways to make coffee at home right now, and just like it would be like a little Twitter thread, just be going over like, hey, this is how I make my coffee in the morning. Because I mean, as at this point, you should know me. Coffee oh, is like one of my one of my things I actually do enjoy. One thing about it is just really relaxing to spend five minutes making a pot of coffee. I mean, having the, the bloom. And I would like to get an espresso machine, but those things are expensive and they take up a lot of space. I just want like a small little one. Like I have this little handheld one that like 
definitely is not I would not say pure espresso but it is pretty good it's like a, it's got a little pump on the side that you actually push in and that that's how you build the pressure and I do find it makes like a decent cup we have um, our neighbor for some weird reason actually gave us Bustillo I think it's Bustillo why does this tree have a pole in it okay and um, it's okay. Like it's it's good for espresso because it's very finely ground. I also think it's not really designed for espresso. I think it's more like designed for co just make the coffee, which would be like very very heavy. You try to do it that way. Oh, door? No, not a door. Okay. People, look. Viewers, if, if I'm running past notes, you can feel free to chew me apart in the comments. I would not blame you one bit. I can't find diddly squat. Ah, Fuddruckers. Well, okay, that one room, we, that one building we found was new. That's, that's a new area. I did not check that out before. Downside being, it did not include anything that was useful to me, but it was new. I'm going back. Oh, my God, I'm going backwards. I'm going back. That's going back towards the radio tower, which I don't want to do. I want to go. I want to try to find that one building that had the little gate on the side that I could climb up. I should be able to climb over the barrel, but I can't. Um, that is a house. That's a tree! Now I'm just putting things out. Anything there? No. Freaking hate these noises in the game. They are so creepy. It's doing a really good job at building up an atmosphere, which I love in games. Give me a good atmospheric style. Are any day this I've been in this building like five times neat shut up woods right, what if I just like clear a path over this way because I'm finding these campfires which I would think would have stuff in them and some of them did I will say that not all of them like this one's got a battery how did I not find this before what is wrong with me? So then, if we go this way, ah, here we go. I think this is it. I think it's up this hill. Or, okay, I wouldn't say so much hill, more like a gentle incline. Where? I don't. Oh, he's over there. Oh, that was close. Ah, okay, here's the gate. Yes, yes, yes. This is perfect. This is good. This is good. It's over here. So it's right on the other side of this thing. Mm, I'm not looking around. I'm not looking back. I will not be looking back in anger. We'll see, maybe. But. What? Why? Why there no thing? Why, why nothing? What the? What is with these boxes that I can do something with, apparently? Okay, let me... I gotta see something. Controls. Interact is just left click. Yeah. Whoa. Okay, that was kind of weird. So I can click on the box. It doesn't do anything. Not good. Ah, no, this is all so bad. Oh my god, I'm stuck. I am stuck here. Until he leaves. If he leaves. Please leave. Oh, no, 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 no. Yep, he's still there. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, he's gone. Oh, thank you. Thank you for leaving me be, Slender. 
how is there nothing here at all though? Like not even a battery or another key. Why did I come here? I did not need to be in this area. Crap. I'm gonna run out of battery at some point. Okay, I'm just gonna refresh that one. I don't know where he is. I, and I do kind of care a little bit. But I am not particularly fond of... Is this a ladder? Can I actually use this ladder? What? What is with these boxes that turn blue? I can't use any ladders. Ladders are a, a foreign object to this character. Oh, no. Mm -mm. Why are you going to put ladders up and not let me use them? Free the ladders. What I always say. What is this room? Please don't tell me this needs a key. This needs a key. God. No. Oh, 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 I used my key on that stupid gate that didn't do anything for me. <sighs> Let's go ahead and just chill for a second. Some of our stamina back. So I'm going to follow this path. I've not seen that building before, which means it's a pretty good sign that I'm in a newish area. Anything over here, like a key, would be greatly awesome. No key. So I'm going to go to the left. My rationale is if I go to the left here, I thought I heard something. I thought I saw something actually. If I go to the left here, I'll be like, hey, when I come back this way, I'll go to the right. Oh crap, I gotta walk that way. I gotta walk this way. Oh. Oh my god. I got, I got back here. I came back here. Okay, so note to self, go to the right, instead. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. Oh. Really tempted to kind of, kind of tempted to just, uh, switch back, switch to easy mode now. And, uh, see what the ending I get is. Oh, another battery. Although I'm pretty sure I did get the battery from this room before. Is there a key? No. No keys. Nothing. So, oh, come on, Slender Man. I'm about to start calling you Slender Boy. Did you just kind of stand there? You're not acting like a man. You're not confronting me. You're just like, eh. No. Just let him kind of run around for a little bit. I'm stuck on a. I'm stuck on a bag. A bag of flour. I don't know what's in there. It could be potatoes, for all I know. Now I'm just kind of roaming the woods. And now I'm hitting the invisible wall. Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna just kind of skip ahead, I think. You don't have to watch me just ramble about everything left and right, all willy-nilly like this. I got myself another battery. And... Oh! Oh, that's bad. That's a bad time right there. I found a boat. I could just, I could just get in the boat. Boat away. Yeah, I'm gonna skip around because it can't be that interesting to watch me just uh, kind of walk through very tall grass, very, very tall grass for a very long amount of time. So I'll see you guys in a moment. This is a different cemetery. And everything's black and white here. I don't know where he is. I can't see him. Oh, there he is. I found him. Oh, that's Slender Man. He's always pulling practical jokes like that. Just kind of standing on the outskirts of the town. Why is everything black and white there? It's so weird. I mean, it's, it's, I, I'm, I'm assuming it's designed to be black and white when in the graveyard there. And it's probably an interesting thing, but at the same time... Why? And why is there syringes just chilling in the woods? Actually, yeah, the epidemic's pretty bad, so I kind of understand why there are. Just why in these woods in this game? It's more my question. I hide in here. No. Just live my, live the rest of my life. Oh my god, I found a key. Oh yay! Anyway, 
Yeah, so let's just go ahead and find our way back to a one room with the thing. Or the one the one door we saw. Is this it, actually? I think this was it. Yeah, this was it. Wow, I'm right here. Perfect. Let's not let's actually not jump ahead then. <laughs> I'll just do this now. And in here we discover a single battery. Am I just bad at games? I can't find item crap. He's right there by the door. So um nope, he's still chilling there. What? Oh no, he's still there. Okay, now it's just getting loud and obnoxious. Okay. Is this far away enough? Nope. Oh, he's probably gonna teleport right on top of me. Give me the old slender touch. Okay. He's gone. We are good. Where? Oh, he's right there. I was like, where? Why? You can't just play the loud noise. You gotta give me a reason. Okay, I'm gonna jump ahead again. Okay, well, I did find the last door I need a key for. I do still need to find the last key, as well as four more freaking notes. Ooh, ooh, okay, the key. I found the key. Just checking around here, see if there's any notes or anything like that. No. All right, so back down the hill we go. The last key was literally here, like right next to the building. Which is perfect. Into here we go, and over here we find another syringe. Great, uh, nothing. Keeping helping a nothing. And in here we find a battery. Perfect. <gasps> another note. Oh my god, it's been so long since we found one of these things. That's great. I love it. Now there's five out of eight, and he's right there. I have to. I have to run past him. I have to get past him. Oh my god. Freaking Slender Man. I'm guessing he's going to be more active since I got more of these notes. Perfect. Alright, so I did find that key going up this hill. It was actually over towards that way, so I'm guessing I have not really been to this area too much. And I'm hoping that that implies there's stuff over here to be discovered. Such as. A fire. Bar uh, a barrel on fire. We did it, everyone, ladies and gentlemen. We found the barrel. I've been here. I found all the keys. It can't, it can't be like each note, like only one note spawns at a time, right? It has to be all the notes are available at all times. Because if it's not, my god. But I haven't seen anything. I need three more. And I've not seen any more notes. And my god, do I get exhausted. Like, if I go back to an area where I was before and I find the note. I guess that's the best. The, that's actually pretty much the indicator that, hey, yeah, that's how it works. There's no note here. There's nothing here, actually. What about inside the church? I don't like that sound. I will have. To, I will say that the one thing that I love about this game is that the batteries respawn. Because if the batteries did not respawn, you were left with whatever you found. Oh no, I would not be happy. Which also actually leads me to an interesting question. Is this Slenderman just giving us batteries? Does Slenderman own stock in Doorcell? Because if so, there's I think there might be some insider trading and the FTC might want to be involved. Can you imagine if Slenderman is taken down by the FTC? That would make headlines. Screw Marble Hornets or anything like that. Like, yeah, just, the government just kind of moves in and is like, hey, yeah, Slenderman, you've been paying taxes and also we found... You are guilty of insider trading due to your stocks of Duracell. 
I don't think he's. I don't think he does that. I think Slenderman's on the cut on on the up and up. I was gonna say cut and dry. That's not really what I intend to say at all. I think Slenderman's legit. Yeah. I mean, like you don't get that tall without being, you know, a decent person. Because obviously we all know decency has to do with height. That's not accurate at all. Like, in the slightest. I'm sure there were some tall, tall bad people. And plenty of short good people. And also there's a crate there. I'm almost at my wits out here. Let's check out this room again. There's a book. There's a breaking sound. Okay. Cool. Neat. I got that. At this point, I'm just collecting batteries. I'm not even caring about the notes anymore. I'm just going to open my own convenience store. Welcome to Flames Convenience Store. We sell batteries. And also batteries. You want batteries? We got batteries. You want spaghetti? We don't got spaghetti. We got batteries. Oh, I don't even... Oh, there he is. It also seems like maybe his radius is getting larger. It's very possible his, his like, I don't know, static radius is, like, getting bigger at the more notes I find. Anything here? These boxes, why are they lit up? I don't trust, I don't trust lit up boxes that don't let me actually do anything. Um... Trying to see if maybe zooming in does something. It doesn't. It, it it didn't really help at all. Like at the slightest. Um. All right. Loop around the building. Check check the outside. We're gonna go around the outside. Around the outside. Much like two trailer park girls. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Where? Where are these last three freaking notes? Place the battery. Chipotle decided he wanted to visit me. Put my mind at ease while up against the Slender Man. Now he's decided to lay next to the green screen while I run into a visible wall. Perfect. This way. Ooh, what's this? It's a big rock. I found the big rock. I don't know where he is. Oh, there he is. I found him. I know where he is. Right around the right around the rock. Playing ring on the rosy with Slenderman. Not exactly what I expected to be doing on a Tuesday night. Yet here we are. Oh, I almost ran right into him. Oh no. Uh, there's got to be a note around here. I mean, like this is too much. Too much of a weird area for there not to be a note here. Or, I'm sorry, a page. I don't want to offend the Slender Man. But you know what? At this point, I do. I'm going to offend Slender Man. I want your notes. Give me your notes. Give me your math homework, nerd. That's... I don't even know where he is. I don't... Oh, there he is. It's very hard to see because it's all red. Don't. There's no note here. I really wish there was like a sound cue. Not for Slenderman. Slenderman's got enough sound cues as it is right now. I don't know where he is. But he's... I could not find all pages. But, if you want to give this a try yourself, the link to this game is in the description box down below. It's, honestly, I like these games. It's... Once you get halfway through, it becomes a grind of just, where do I go? Um, I might play easy mode just to take a look at it, but, oh, or you can just click on it now. But at this point, the video is going on for way too long. So if you enjoyed this game, let me know in the comments down below. Give me a thumbs up. I really do appreciate that. And also make sure you're subscribed to get updates for at least new content or go live while live streaming. And as always, have a great day. Remember to burn bright. I'll talk to you later. Bye.